Hello, and welcome to another how-to guide. Today, we will be discussing how to set up Streamlabs chatbot, how to set up scripts, commands, and visual shoutouts. I stream Monday, Wednesdays, Friday, and Saturdays at 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you have questions on anything, please feel free to stop by. Let's get started. The first step to using Streamlabs chatbot is to navigate to streamlabs.com forward slash chatbot. You will then find a download now button. Before you get into Streamlabs chatbot, you need to ensure that you have made a Twitch account for your bot. Once you have that account, you go to connections in the bottom left, you will click on the Twitch bot section and select generate token. This will open up a second authorization page on the bot. Once you click authorize, it'll automatically fill in the token in the token field. Once you have connected your bot, you need to go down to Twitch streamer. You will click on generate token, which opens a second page where you will also authorize chatbot on Twitch. Once you've done that, you will select connect and chatbot will be up and running. Now you can get into the fun of adding commands, sound effects, and GIFs if so be. Adding a command is self-explanatory. You select the add button, type in the command, and then type in your response. You can also attach sound files. I will show you later in the video how to have GIFs and sound files show up on the stream at the same time. Adding a sound file is just as simplistic. You hit add, Type in the name of your sound file. Make sure you decide what volume you want it at, which you can use preview for to see the sound level. You select your file, automatically generate command, and then you can set the permissions and any cooldowns you'd like. If you are using another bot other than chatbot, you don't have to worry about much of the other subsections here. However, in the description below, I will put a link to the entire chatbot documentation guide. Now here comes the fun part for adding scripts to your chatbot, which will allow you to have things like this, or things like this, you must follow the following steps. You will first navigate to python.org's website. I will put a link in the description below. You will then download Python 2.7.13. It is imperative that this is the version that you download as this is the only one that works on chatbot. You will then download the Windows x86-64 MSI installer. Once you are done, you will navigate to the Python 27 folder and you will select the lib directory and click save. Once you have done those steps, you can navigate over to Streamlabs chatbot discord where they have an entire channel dedicated to script development. As you can see, I have two scripts currently running, CLP and caster overlay. Caster overlay pulls the avatar picture from Twitch and displays it on screen when you do a shout out. CLP, or also known as Caster's Lazy Pack, is how I have GIFs show up on stream. To install a script, you simply click the import button at the top, you navigate to the appropriate zip file, and hit open. This will automatically import the script that you downloaded. Once you are done with that, you right click on the appropriate script and hit insert API key. To add GIFs, you simply need to type what I have written in the response here. However, this will be the location of wherever your image or GIF is. The number at the end is for how long it will be displayed for. For these to show up on your stream, you will need to right click and go to the script folder. Once you have the script folder open, you will need to select the overlay.html. You will need to import this as a browser source in your respective streaming software. You will need to do this for any scripts that you intend to display on your screen. Please keep in mind that chatbot must be open when your stream is running for the commands to work. If you have more specific questions, I will link the documentation below and you can also ask questions in the comments and I will get back to you. If you like this video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications. And as always, have fun gaming.